All my life I've been told that I can't succeed. It made me feel bad about myself. I felt like nothing was going right in my life. Christian does a beautiful tournée. I took Miss Stephenson's class because I wanted to see if I can handle everything she dishes out. If you use a convection oven, what is the temperature going to be? Up, oh, wrong seat, 100 push-ups. Every single person in this class will receive a $5,000 scholarship from the Amo. <laughs> Christian, you're first. Christian, come on up here, sir. Yeah, I was speechless. I was, I was just in shock to actually see that people are just giving us money just to be ourselves and follow our dreams. It shows that the hard work actually pays off. The first time I was diagnosed with leukemia, I was two. On my first relapse, I fell in love with cooking. Rachel Way uh, does good sorts of comfort food that just really fits me. It was just a lot of fun to think of recipes I can make. And I just thought I had so many good recipes, why don't I do a cookbook? So I consulted my mom and she thought it was a great idea and we found a book agent and we got my dream come true. I know a big part of this whole process for you has been to raise money for cancer research and I was just wondering, like ballpark figure, about how much have you made so far? I've raised over $100,000 for pediatric leukemia research. That's fantastic. Today, I'm gonna cook for you. Growing up, I struggled going to school and socializing. And being in the kitchen was my way of just being myself and building up my confidence. I want to show other people that no matter what your challenge is, it can't hold you back. Winning this contest would be an absolute game changer. So the winner of the $25,000 is Nick. Alessandra, she was on Guy's team on our Guy vs. Rage Kids Cook-Off. She's 12 years old, but she cooks like a master chef. I think I like to show people and kids that they could be cooking other things besides peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. <laughs> I think you guys are going to be overpaying for their food in restaurants and watching all of them on TV sometime soon. She's amazing. All right, guys, uh, let's welcome Jack, Christian, Alessandra, and Nick. Oh, I just wanted to say thank you so much, Rachel. Um, I'm actually celebrating my seventh year for my bone marrow transplant. Yeah! So I'm completely healthy. And I'm being on the Rachel vs. Guy Kids cook-off, I was actually able to get an investor and I'm starting my own company. Awesome! Chef Jack's Sconies, so it'll be launching uh, later this month. That's amazing, congratulations! Oh, happy birthday. Thank you yeah. so much. I cannot thank you enough for what you've done for me. Um, with this scholarship that I received, I was able to graduate college. And now I work for the Union League of Philadelphia, which is the number one country club in the United States. Amazing. And I am planning to be a teacher. Fantastic. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. I just want to thank you so much for always being a role model to me. I'm just starting college now at Fordham University studying business with the hope to one day merge culinary and business, like you've clearly exactly, done so well. Exactly what you said <laughs> years ago when I met you. And all of the kids that day, it was such a close contest. All of the kids that day had such great stories. But behind the scenes, I did tell everybody, he's got to take it. <laughs> I didn't decide, but I, I, I forecasted pretty good. Well, with your $25,000 scholarship, I'm going to the number one culinary school in America, <laughs> the Culinary Institute of America. And Amazing! And You're not, gonna crush it! And not only did you just give me the money, <laughs> you changed my name from Nick to the Rachel Ray kid. <laughs> <laughs> so everybody, my, even my parents introduced me as the Rachel Ray, the Rachel Ray son now. <laughs> That's weird, man. That's really weird, and I apologize. Congratulations to all of you, and uh, we're just so happy to do it. And you know, it, it, it really has been the cornerstone of our brand since day one is to give back to the community and pay it forward. I don't have human kids, I have a pit bull. So I consider <laughs> that I am a, a one one-thousandth parent to all of you. And it's an <laughs> honor to be involved in this.